Hey everybody, came across a rather funny situation in the Outer Worlds, which involves doing Ellie's companion quest, which involves visiting her parents at their very, very swanky Byzantium estate. You can, of course, attack and kill her parents if you want to, because you can attack anybody in this game. But I got to thinking, I wonder if Ellie would attack her own parents, and what would happen if you made her do that? And it turns out, yes, you can. I, I targeted one of her parents and told Ellie to attack, and uh, she unleashed fury, which was just morbidly funny to watch for some reason. But once the fight was over, she got absolutely livid, flipped her lid, because apparently I had killed her parents. So then, of course, she wants nothing more to do with you. She leaves the party and is no longer available as a companion, which is the normal outcome of attacking her parents. So then I tried it again, and this time I let Ellie do all of the attacking. I didn't lift a finger to help her at all. And she eliminated both of her parents with extreme prejudice. And then the same thing happened. She got livid at me for uh, attacking and killing her parents. Which leads me to conclude one of two things. Either she was blinded by rage and then doesn't remember doing the attacking and assumes that you did it, or she's a mind-controlled drone and at some point you, you installed like a chip or, or something in her head that controls her actions so that she must obey your commands, but then uh, once she regains control over her own self, she gets mad at you for making her do that. Anyway, I thought this whole situation was rather funny. What in the void did you do? Then out of curiosity, I tried something else. I sent Ellie back to the ship, then I went in and eliminated her parents, and then uh, went back to the ship and flew around the galaxy and everything seems fine until the next time you talk to her. And then she flips out at you in the, in, in the very same way. Of course, she, she will patiently wait until you're free and until you have a moment to have a casual chat before she'll rip you a new one and tell you that she's uh, leaving your crew for doing this horrible, horrible thing. Go figure. Just another interesting facet of Ellie's character. If you're interested in more Outer Worlds content, I'm doing a full playthrough as an evil character, but also a dumb character. So I dropped my intelligence attribute to the lowest option, and that unlocks the dumb options in dialogue. And uh, the way I'm playing it is, if there's a dumb option, I must pick the dumb option. Plus, we're doing the quest line where you betray Phineas and a whole bunch of other delightfully evil things. So if you're interested in that, there's a link to the playlist below. I'll also put a card on the screen right now. Been a lot of fun. Please slam that like button if you enjoyed this. Leave comments below, and I will... Talk to you later. What in the void did you do? Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, sub, and hit that notification bell, and then check out some of these other videos. Find the link to our Discord server and other important stuff in the description below.